Hello and welcome to another episode of Elastic Planet 21 and I am your host C. I have my wonderful co-host G here with me as well and we are here with another um, fun doll unboxing today. This is the Dreamtopia Barbie. Um, I'm not exactly sure. Let me actually take a look at this packaging here. Maybe it'll actually have the full name here. It doesn't really say. It just says Dreamtopia. And it just says Barbie. But it's actually, it comes with these uh, multi-changeable, like, kind of outfits. Um, one's like a princess. One's a fairy there. And it looks like one's a mermaid. I'm very excited about the mermaid outfit because I love those type of outfits that can be easily removed. But, you know, you can also kind of like create, um, you know, like a nice little partner or friend for a, a, another mermaid doll that you may have. So this is like a little fun little uh, pack that I wanted to unbox today. So, yeah, we have three models that we will be using for this unboxing video. Although this doll, I mean, although this uh, fashion pack does come with a doll, um, I always think that's nice when they include a doll as well. Um, this just is not, you know, I'm not a big fan of the smiling, um, four points of articulation type doll. So we will be changing her out for a posable doll. But what we decided to do is we use like three different girls so that each one of the outfits we can actually have them, you know, being displayed at one time. So you can kind of see how they kind of translate on also different doll bodies. But I want to get my wonderful co-host in here to tell you what he thinks about this wonderful fashion pack and these dolls. As well. Hey guys, we are back with another video. So um, before even unboxing or opening big spots, uh, just looking at our models uh, that we're going to use tonight, we wanted to, you know, uh, incorporate diversity in this particular video, not just diversity in their skin tones but also diversity in their looks uh, all these don't have you know obviously different face sculpt all of them have different hairstyle um, and all of them are not even built the same they have right. different they're all articulated dolls but they also look different their makeup is different one you know has a bold strong um, black lips the other one has the soft um, beautiful uh, purple you know fairy i think she looks more fairy and the other one has the um you know nude leap um sexy nude leap so um i love all those different uh, looks that come with so you know in the comment before we put them in these you know uh dream topia outfit which i'm excited about uh you guys tell us what you think about the original look uh which um i will see really worked on um you know like i say it's not like something we sit and think about but you know uh, as we you put one outfit and then you try to accessorize it so this is our first model and she looks beautiful in this pink outfit um really cute really cute i love her little like like this is the type of smile we want she's not making a fierce face mm -hmm. she's not like some uh, but she's smizing mm -hmm. uh if you remember what tyra banks uh, does smizing she is smiling with her eyes her lips is a little bit just uh, extended a little bit but you don't see her teeth I love this it's mm -hmm. very subtle so that's our first model mm -hmm. and uh, we have the one in the middle uh, guys I'm sorry I don't know their name so I'm just gonna call them you know just excuse me uh, first of all look at this hair guys look at this silky beautiful hair so i have been dreaming about us using this doll again she is one of my favorite face sculpt her uh and the makeup whoever did the makeup just did a good job the hair goes beautiful with this doll she is very ethereal very um 
dreamy oh i've been waiting for this doll i'm sorry guys i'm talking too much about this doll but <laughs> she's one of my favorite dolls and this outfit on her look at it she should be she should have come in this box already guys uh, I, i'm sorry she should, she should have come in this box beautiful purple outfit matching her you know sometimes i don't like too much matchy matchy but it goes well it goes well what can i add? look at those beautiful shoes she's wearing as well and you know like i said these are just outfit they're coming with before we change them into the other one but we just, we just wanted to show you guys and yeah so that's our second model hey girl go sit over there <laughs> um so this is our third model the fierce beautiful uh barbie signature doll she like i said originally she came with uh, a short uh, small short body mm -hmm. uh, we rebodied her we changed her hairstyle multiple times mm -hmm. but this is also one of my favorite looks on her this hairstyle looks beautiful on her hair uh, uh, I don't know maybe because of the pony on top of her she has a beautiful face she has a face cock that I love it's beautifully uh, sorry for the uh, repeating myself like in French we say tautology but uh, sorry to repeat myself but uh, her face is um, beautifully sculpted and for this type of faces like your hair can be up to show us that beautiful sculpt if you have a similar type of face so uh, look at this hairstyle very beautiful model she is the model of the group mm -hmm. very stunning and uh, i love the little outfit like she doesn't need much mm -hmm. she, like a simple outfit she doesn't need much she's gonna stand out anyways so she's wearing red shoes uh beautiful red shoes right there so yeah we just wanted to show you guys this is what they come with before you see them change into this dreamland um other than that i'm excited to get them out of the box all right guys so um not much to add really um you guys can see um the outfit looks beautiful i like the theme um i like the theme as i was talking about earlier uh, i was wondering how those wings go on the um, on the doll so they actually snap in uh um like you know like the doll stand the way it sits on the waist of the doll that's kind of how um those um wings um sit on the doll so that's one thing i was pleased about because i was wondering uh if we'll be able to put it on a different doll uh, and uh this fairy outfit actually guys by itself it's it's you know this is really a nice outfit in, in my opinion i was like you know if you remove the wings you remove the one um the outfit by itself is really a look you can actually you know go out with i see it as a look but um it still looks really cute as a fairy tale uh, and it's beautiful tell us what you think about this uh, fairy tale look on this doll and uh, I was joking earlier saying that this is a fairy tale you don't want to mess with I mean a, uh, a fairy mm -hmm. you don't want to mess, mess with she has that look where this one is to give you life give you everything you dreamed of but at the same time it can break your neck mm -hmm. so she's not playing <laughs> um, but then we move to our I want to talk to about the princess then I'll talk about the um, uh, the mermaid uh, in a second uh, but the princess look I felt like this was this uh, is a first it's really a first because we used we used to princess having this softer look she's very soft in her face but uh, for the lip choice that we picked we wanted to we wanted to show that difference like I was saying earlier your doll doesn't have to fit a particular look um and so this is the first usually we don't see princesses with um you know a, a statement bold uh lip color they may wear red but like um uh, the i don't i don't even know if this is black it looks like a really deep purple mm -hmm. 
um, brown so uh, I love it I love it it's different it's unique it's special it's one of a kind um, really beautiful I love it she comes with this um, beautiful it, it's supposed to be a dress but uh, the the outfit doesn't come like together like so it's, it's a bottom part the skirt and then the top part uh, is that hard um, plastic um, the top part and then just together it gives that look of a dress and she comes with those shoes those blue those shoes are actually really cute mm -hmm. they're actually really cute it was a little hard to put them on this dog just because the, uh, the, her feet are she has an ankle joint she has an ankle joint and it, you know it, it moves so it was kind of hard to put it in because the dog that came with these outfits her feet she has a stiff body mm -hmm. so it's made to just get in there and stay beautiful shoes i like the look and as you can see those tops are like the back are and uh open they're not like uh fully all around as you can see all of them the backs are open i think it's that way so it'd be easy to put it on because if it was closed it would have been harder uh, to adjust it other than that did she come with those earrings or those are the earrings we gave her originally i can't remember no we gave her those okay those are the beautiful earrings uh she borrowed from us mm -hmm. um she had to return them but yes um that's our princess look tell us what you think about the princess look now we're gonna move to our mermaid so this is our mermaid um i'm, I'm having a dog crash over here um <laughs> Really, she is a really really pretty doll the colors on her is beautiful and I think um, uh, uh, it was a really beautiful choice originally we were trying to get her to be the fairy uh, however this outfit couldn't fit on the doll that's right now the fairy so um, because of the feet so she has uh, those stiff ankles her ankle don't move like like um like the gorilla girl said my hair they don't move her feet don't move <laughs> so um but i love this outfit i love the color like it just complements everything she it's like she was made for this outfit she she's like that she has that look of like i say dream like the like this collection this outfit is called dreamtopia so she has that look of a dream she's like like ethereal like i said it earlier she is very dreamy and uh i love and i don't know if we can show but um this the bottom part of um of, of our tail well not the bottom part the tail opens like that's how we got it on, on, on we got her to wear it so she still has her feet Mm -hmm. But we can open that part, put it on her, and like you know, like Ariel when she's in the water, yep. she is uh, a mermaid. But when she comes out on the land, she has she still has her feet on them. And this is something we really, uh, uh, you know, in our videos you see earlier we talked about uh, uh, mermaids, mermaid dolls, beautiful dolls, really well done. But the only thing. Like we like uh, in on this channel uh, in our collections of dolls. One thing we like is like for our dolls not to be uh, stuck in a particular look. We want them to be able to move. Even when we do their hair, like you, like you see, some people will put product to get the hair stiff and stay in one way. We like the hair to be able to move. We like that freedom of going from one look to another. Um, you know, so that we can have that. Um, um, you know. Um, so we can have that liberty of changing the looks and stuff like that mm -hmm. um, That's one thing I wanted to point out um, But yeah, so the tail opens beautiful tail the design on the tail is so beautiful and uh, The bottom part of the tail That's very royal that looks like royal to me mm -hmm. <laughs> and I love it and uh, beautiful like I said the back of this the top part of the outfit also is open like there's nothing but it makes sense because it'll be easier because it's a hard I don't know if it's a plastic but I'll call it plastic for people that know what these materials are called but it looks like plastic to me so I'll call it plastic for now so but it looks like a hard plastic and it's hard to if it was covered in the back to put it on but these dogs 
it, it's a lot of work to take the head off, put it back, so. But yeah, uh, that's what I wanted to say about this, uh, do I'm sorry, this uh, mermaid look. Tell us what you think about this look. Absolutely. Now, I agree 100% with my wonderful co-host here as well, but I wanted to actually get a real mermaid doll out really quick. That way we can compare a traditional mermaid doll from this mermaid dress-up doll that we actually kind of recreated with the fashion pack. So we're gonna have, we're gonna present beautiful harmony a unboxing for this doll. I absolutely love the Mermaid's line. It wasn't until I got these dolls is when I really fell in love with their looks. And I just, I think these are some of the cutest, most um, unique dolls. The only critique I will have, just like my wonderful co-host had mentioned, I just wish that they had real feet. If they could, if this was something that you can take off, just like this outfit here, and she could have feet underneath, that would have completed um, this doll for me as far as she would have had all the, she would have checked all the boxes, I guess you'll say. So, well, what I'm gonna do here really quick is I'm going to put them side by side. Now, of course, she's not on a stand, so she's not gonna sit as high as her, but I'm just gonna sit her there. And they have a very similar look too. They're actually, it's cause I guess it's because of the skin tone and the hair colors and I stuff like too. that. Yes, I, I think that they really, um, they look a lot alike. I think that this is really a nice pairing here. So I'm gonna sit her there. Hopefully she'll balance up, and she does. Yeah, that so, was the thing we wanted to compare it to. And uh, you can see it, um, the mermaid's doll, and I think they have like close to similar proportion on the tail part portion. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so they could have given her feet, and uh, on the mermaid's doll, they could have given her feet and could have taken it out. Um, Let me just show you all that. Mm -hmm. So, yep, you're actually right. Mm -hmm. Very similar. Yeah, very similar proportions. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, that, it would have been nice, Mermaids. It would have been nice. It would have been nice. But everything else is beautiful. And um, we, we love, love these looks. But one thing I wanted to add uh, that came from this box with the uh, uh, Dream Topia. This little princess thing, um, <laughs> it's beautiful. I think like it's it's really interesting that it incorporated. I mean, it, the fairy thing, a because, fairy cut out. Yeah, it, it could be like a collection. Um, mm -hmm. Children, if you buy this, the, your children can maybe put it on their wall or Absolutely. something. So I felt like I wanted to point that out as well. Coming out as well, both like it was interesting. It's it's nice the kid can put it on the wall or wherever they want to put it this was interesting and interesting and uh, i liked it it's just paper but it's nice <laughs> if you have children this will be an interesting uh thing like especially if they come with other dreamtopia uh mm -hmm. each each box comes with a different you object. collect these. you collect them mm -hmm. so i felt like this was interesting and i wanted to point that out as well people that are subscribed thank you for the people that just what watching our video for the first time or coming on our channel for the first time welcome to the family elastic planet 21 we hope you come back we hope you uh, consider subscribing if this is some content that you are interested in watching uh, we don't want to force people but if this is something you're interested in watching and you find it entertaining uh, you are welcome to join our family we are welcome you with open arms so please continue watching our videos continue subscribing continue sharing please if you could uh, uh, consider turning your post no notification uh, on that way you don't miss any video whenever we post and other than that guys we love you and appreciate all the support please don't forget to come comment don't forget to comment. Tell us what you think about the, this video. What you think about the looks. Uh, uh, would you prefer to put the, the different doll on this look? And, uh, you know, whichever, whatever you think. Tell us. We love the feedback because we are learning as well. And we're growing uh, as well. So, uh, we know there's a lot of people on this channel that are 
very uh, they're you know they're collectors as well and they know uh, a, a little more than we do we want you guys to tell us what you think we want you to share your knowledge with us as well so not only us will learn but other people that read the comment can learn as well so yeah thank you thank you all for watching us today and we will see you all in our next video bye 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 <laughs>